Greetings, YouTube. Welcome back to the channel. When you're sick, you know, you never know what's going to make you feel better. I am not somebody who NyQuil usually works on. Some people, it just knocks them out. I'm very envious. I have to do three doses, and it still takes me about two hours to fall asleep. That's because I'm hashtag Team Insomnia. Those of you who have been following the channel for years know that. Uh, this morning, I posted a video where after I sent an email to the Marvel Insider staff appealing my ban, I talked about how this is what the ban said. Uh, it said, you are ineligible, by the way, good crumble cookies this week. Uh, you're ineligible to participate in the Marvel Insider Loyalty Rewards Program. For more details, please see the Marvel Insider Loyalty Rewards Program Terms of Use. So again, I studied it. I tried to think objectively as to whether or not I had broken any of the terms of use on my YouTube channel. And I came to the conclusion that I had not. And so I emailed them wanting to know specifics as to why I was deemed ineligible to continue in the program and effectively banned from using the program. Well, good news and bad news. The bad news is I have not received a single response from the staff directly. And maybe I never will. Maybe they know. If they respond to me directly, I will probably put the message in a YouTube video. And maybe they don't want that to happen. I don't know. But what I do know, as I darken the screen, is I logged in first on mobile and then on desktop to see what the update was. And what do you know? I once again, on my profile, have the ability to do activities and claim rewards. And so it appears for the moment, and hopefully this is the last video I have to do on this, but if they ban me again, I guess I'll have to do a follow-up. Uh, it appears for the moment like I have been unbanned and that somebody at Marvel thought, uh-oh, this may actually not look good if we keep this. I don't know. I don't know what they were thinking. I just know it looks like anybody else who has the ability to get in the game or get into the program, I should say. And speaking of games, remember this month, we've got this, the Contest of Champions pin starter bundle which gives you a two-star Ant-Man, a two-star Wasp, a two-star Yellow Jacket, a two-star Ghost. So if you're missing any of those, five small energy refills and a pathetic amount of gold. But it's usually the 125,000 point bundle that is what you want to go after. And this thing contains two Grandmaster Crystals. Again, that's probably just two three-stars. It's not a big deal at all. A four-star Hero Crystal, not a big deal at all. Uh, 500 five-star shards. So this is the first time that we've seen free five-star shards in these, to my knowledge. Pretty big deal. Five uncollected crystal shard crystals. No big deal. Three fully formed energy refills. 15,000 gold. Now, I will say this. I usually save my points, because they are getting down there, for a combination of energy refills and free revives. Since I don't have that many more points than this offer, I will probably not purchase that. And I'll save the 151,000 points for the April month offer, assuming I even still have access by then. If somebody from Marvel Insider is watching this video, I appreciate that you reversed my ban. Uh, I am just trying to promote this program to as many people as possible because I think it has amazing benefits for things that most people are already doing. And so I'm not saying I expect any compensation for it because I don't, but I do view us on the same team in this regard. It's ironic that my channel often gets labeled as too negative, but then whenever I do pro Marvel Insider videos, I get labeled as too positive. Like I've somehow got a secret deal with them under the table, which of course I don't. But uh, yeah, that's just the life of a uh, YouTuber even when sick. So uh, thanks for watching. Have a good one. And uh, yay.
for the appeal actually working.